Welcome back, people, and I am uh, back for more trouble, I guess, as we continue Corporate Conquest. In the last episode, we had a very glitchy, or at least um, technical difficulties in the audio, audio department with Kaboof, but got through it nonetheless, and we are going to work on uh, Doho and Ferric Fellows. So, uh, you know, more of the same Civil War BS that's going on here. But uh, it shouldn't be too bad. A new alloy being developed in secret could end the civil war. Both sides race towards completion. One side's going to get demolished. That's what you're telling me. It seems like there may be something of value to us here after all. If we can, if we claim the market here, that alloy could be ours. Remember, time spent captured will be taken out of your pay. Get the factory functioning and profitable again. We're a robot, so does it really matter? Alright, so we got... Alright, so we have a factory already built for us. Alright, so let's kind of soak in everything here. Alright. A lot of, um... Brer and whatnot. I, I forget what we were calling those things. Uh, okay, so this is our base that's been pre-made for us. I love those kind of setups. Not really, but still. Okay, so... It's a weird start. Pretty weird start. I don't like when they start us out like this. It kind of... takes the thought process out of uh, the whole beginning. Crap. Takes a th uh, thought process out of the whole uh, system. I mean, you, usually I'm more used to, um, you know, thinking out how to set everything up here, what direction I might want to take things. But when you already go, you know, past that point and just say, "Here's your base, do something with it," it's like I appreciate the thought and everything, but it's kind of lame. But then again, this whole setup seems really awkward. This whole location and whatnot is kind of interesting. And I'm just going to assume they're like hosed up in some stupid location, because they usually are. They're not the smartest. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Yeah, how's this feel, huh? Okay, so they're just holed up here. Well, a bunch of idiots, man. And, uh... See, I just... You know what? Let's just take these ingredients here, because, uh... And these things are... They're hardy. They're hardy little things, that's for sure. They take a hell of a beating. And there we go. So thank God for that. And let's uh, make ourselves a soup for once. And just so we don't expend like any unnecessary oxygen because God knows this robot, this robot loves to have his oxygen. Makes no sense. Dark Masher. Yeah, something good did come out of this, uh, ep this little planet so far. Oh no. I don't even know what you do really, but... Son of a... That was definitely not the intended um, decision. Oh, man. God, that sucks. And Wow, they sent two cans of soup, really. That's how this game is going to play me. Oh, pumpkin people. Although I never... They never seem to stay consistently. They're more disappointments, if anything else, really. And we can hear music this time, so that's uh, definitely a plus. Okay, so... Really? What's going on here? Oh, I just destroyed your nest. I'm sorry. Sorry, is there a problem here, sir? 
Just don't back me into a corner, man. You'll be fine. Wow, so our competition already got two cans of soup on us. And that's that's a big problem. It's a huge problem. Especially since I unwisely uh, spent the cash before on some really useless crap. This is going to be a hell of a start though. Not even sure where to take this exactly. I'm going to get these research discs, that's for sure. Get some gum out of the deal. But still is a little confusing as, as to what I'm going to do exactly. A lot of pumpkins there. Maybe I can just demolish the whole uh, population there and uh, kind of work with that. Because the pre-made stuff that they have already uh, set up for us, it kind of bothers me. Because I don't think that reflects exactly what's what um, what materials we actually have to work with here. Okay, so we have a stash of uh, crates somewhere, so that's great. Doesn't help me much right now, so... You know. Alright, let's uh, place a mushroom there. And let's kind of get rid of some of these pre-built ones here. Grass and a flower. Yeah, okay, no. Get rid of that. Don't be afraid to, uh, well. Great. Alright, so yeah, a lot of uh, extra work comes with this uh, territory here. Was well, like, there's no way I'm going to work with that kind of ingredient. And we'll try and automate the process as much as possible here. It's, it's only so much you can really do. I mean, corn people. Where am I going to find a bunch of corn people? And the answer is, I have no idea. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's uh, kind of get these pumpkin people here. Because they intrigue me a bit. Oh. Okay, these guys. And you know what? Uh, let's actually get ourselves a nice... Well, I was going to suggest getting ourselves a nice weapon, but... Kill these stupid pumpkins quickly. Alright, I'm going in too deep here. Alright, get the hell out of there, man. Crap. Thank God they don't force you to drop uh, whatever you're holding when you're actually uh, running out of air like this. That would suck. Especially if you had like a long trek home or something like that. A sloppy shroom. Mm, yummy. Sounds like a good time. Where's the fucking competition, man? Alright, so do we have... Oh yes, we do. Okay, perfect. We can actually make something out of this. Uh, leave that there for a second while we uh, take care of this here. Well, I punched this for a good day or so. Come on. Now, I wonder what's directly uh, below us there. I saw something moving, but I just couldn't exactly make out what that was. And we have a can of soup there. That's kind of a shame to see. But I do want to see what that robot does exactly. I know he regulates stuff. Or at least some kind of regulation. Just not sure what kind of regulation. There we go. Send that crap out. Just with this kind of setup, I know it's going to be a lot of like... It's going to be a lot of hand-holding for the most part. Because... I, I mean, I'm sure there's plenty of ways to automate this process, but... What? Just not thinking of it. Okay, let's grab that. Yeah. And we got some pumpkin people there. Plenty of them too, so I'm going to be visiting them again. Kind of bothers me that we have those other freaking things also. Alright, there. We got that going. Good. Good. Everybody likes this. And you did not grab the soup. How dare you? you gotta be kidding me. Wait, we need that. I kind of want to work with more of those pumpkin holes, pumpkin people. 
That's because those are pretty cool looking, uh, things. And I don't have enough money for that. We have enough money for Travis, though, so... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That's why this sucks. Can he, uh, launch it? Oh my god, this is... This is kind of useless. I mean, okay. Oh, he just drops right there. That's... What's the point of having these soup machines right here? Oh, this is such a waste. Just wasting my life on that. Yeah, so this is going to be a kind of slow-moving world, I guess. Just demolish all these fruit pumpkins here. Oh, and I grabbed, like, the two ingredients I didn't need. Ha. <laughs> that figures. But yeah, less automation, but more motion on my part is going to be needed here. It's up to me to save the day. This is soup, mother truckers. Alright, so let's get this crap out here because, well, not in the mood for anything else, man. Not in the mood. Uh, that is such a waste if I do that, though. I would not forgive myself. Here, make yourself useful and grab that and choke and die on it. Thank you. Alright, so let's grab some yams here because I'm sure they're pretty much grown at this point. Yeah. Wish I had a sword or something. Actually, I could afford it, but... Do I want to go there? That's the question. There we go. Same old routine. And let's, uh... God knows I would... Mm, well, that's fine. And I have to babysit this one, because, uh... There's nothing I can really do otherwise, because I can't use Travis or anything to kind of send them out. Uh, do you want to go? You want to go? Come here, come here, come here. What a freaking tool, man. Yeah, if anything, we can probably mess these guys up pretty well. Too bad they can fight pretty well, too. They're on their own right, they can fight pretty hard. So they kind of scare me a bit. Oh, but... I don't know, what were they going design-wise with this uh, particular stage? Other than, you know, kind of irritating me with how this, this whole this whole thing is laid out. And uh, let's destroy this. We need soup rockets. We don't need extra little tunnels here. To make us feel warm and fuzzy and all that crap. Get in here. We need rockets and we need, we need them now. But surprisingly, um, well this is kind of something I don't like to say is uh, we haven't really had any encounters lately. Yeah, it's always a very bad thing to say. Uh, if something's going good, just don't mention it. Just let it keep going as it is. But the second you mention that, you know, something's actually going pretty well for you. That's when things actually go pretty bad. And what gum did I eat exactly? I don't remember making that decision. It seems like our competition kind of uh, lost steam here. You know, freaking coward that they are. You know. Let's uh, kick the crap out of these pumpkin people again. Got a field day with this. Could just get a whole bunch of uh, Arthurs, I guess, right? Yeah, a whole bunch of Arthurs. Just let them go, like, heap shit in that place. And then I'll come back. And, uh, you know, those, those ingredients should be available to me readily. And, oh my god, okay, see? I was saying things were going pretty well, but then, sure enough. Sure enough, he sends two more cans of soup out. 
Thanks. I don't think I really need it, though. Wow, so, uh, let's see. He's going to get, yeah. Rotten cheater, man. Well, I hope he doesn't send soup out like that, you know, too often. So that'll be a problem. And I swear, there's got to be fish underneath there. It seems like it. Just can't tell, though. And we don't even we don't have enough money for shit. Ugh. Oh, great. Yeah, this is why I hate this setup so badly. We have a bunch of soup factories in the middle that absolutely don't do anything for you. Because you can't put a Travis in between there, you'll just fall to the next level. And then that pretty much renders him useless, as it is, so. It's kind of a stupid situation, but a stupid situation I have to m pretty much make peace with. Interesting looking stage, though. What is that, tomatis? I don't even want to know how a tomatis got here. I don't see any nest for it. And of course, they're not there ever. And these guys also despawned, so that's great. Oh, power crystal, so that's something. But the important thing is just not to lose steam at this point. Uh, you know, we got something going here, but you know, while not ideal, it's still something nonetheless. Alright, so let's uh, gently take these out of the fucking ground here. Any day now, seriously. And let's make some soup out of this crap. We want this. Why, oh, sir? Pumpkin people, you just can't make uh, You can't use them as a very reliable source of uh, a soup ingredient, because he's never around. And there is, okay, there's a wave I was uh, trying to look for for the longest time. Oh, they're probably going to be on the bottom anyway, so who cares. I'm not going to sweat that. And, damn. Competition, yet again, is uh, trying to screw us over. Oh, man. Kind of brutal. And there's a shitload of those guys. Oh my god. I think I'm going to need like a sword or something for this job. Wow. Here, grab that. Don't take that. You're not going to do anything with it. Yeah, they're probably going to be like right in the bottom there. I know it. Just know it with a certainty. So let me get my uh, sword all handy here. Oh shit, like that. I knew it. Alright, chop these guys up nice and, uh, something like Alright, well, I wasn't expecting to have to, uh, replant everything here, but sure enough, here we are. This is the reality. Alright, so let's see. Can we do something with this uh, particular s ingredient? Uh, probably. Maybe. Let's toss that there quickly. And we need the pumpkin head people. Badly. So that's kind of part of our uh, little ingredient uh, spiel here. Whatever I'm trying to say. I don't know. Need a yam for that. No pumpkins over there, so what about this side? Anything different? Hopefully. Please, gonna cut me a break. No. Well, let's grab some of these yams here. And wasn't really expecting to do that, but I shouldn't be surprised, really. I'm trying to do gardening with a sword. You know the results every time. It's just gonna be really messy. Alright, so we got this. Uh, I, I want to get rid of this badly. This is just becoming a pain in the butt. I'm trying to work with that? It's just 
not something I want to spend too much time on, to be honest. So might as well just make a new ingredient out of it. But yeah, so far, biggest complaint of this has been, uh... Sorry. Let me just switch over to a different weapon here. This is just a stage that requires a whole lot of hand-holding. I mean, sure, maybe if I had better foresight or something, I could uh, think of a, you know, some kind of neat... Oh, I just saw a pumpkin person there, I think. Although that person was jumping like a tomatus, though. Definitely like a tomatus. Pumpkin people. Yeah, a resource we don't even have a really uh, reliable. Uh, yeah, it's not. It's just not reliable. Uh, if you know where some are, then please let me know because I would be really interested. So God knows, they're really like the most elusive creature on earth. All right, so let's grow that there. All right, good. I love that sword so much, man. You have no idea. You just have no idea, man. And again, I can actually build some travises on the bottom floor at least. Kind of work with that a little bit here. You know, if anything, might as well make some kind of a situation out of this crap that we have here. So one Travis there. And already this guy is sending soup out. This dumb. It's dumb, I tell ya. And, okay, we got a pumpkin person there. Good. Welcoming committee. Oh, there's corn people after all. Oh. Bam. Here you go, you're dead. Congratulations. Uh, drop that there for a moment, and good. <laughs> Come on, it's just grabbing an item, that's all. Not hard. Not as hard as you would think it would be. And we're going, be, going to be down at 50%, that's great. Story of my life. Again, maybe not a good idea to um, actually use another pumpkin person for an, a soup. And I should not use a sword on that guy. It's not his fault. It's not his fault. He's pissing me off. All right, so pumpkin person, couple yams over there. Um. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. Well, I guess I can make use of that. I guess right. Grow that, and let's uh, use this. Good. Jeez. Guy's keeping us busy, that's for sure. I was not expecting this much competition from this guy. But, I'm gonna have to do this. Ugh, man. And of course, this guy's. Yeah, this whole middle s oh, okay, it's just gonna float up, that's fine. This whole middle section is so s just not right. It's not right, I tell ya. Alright, so that's being sent out, that's good, that's fine and dandy and all that crap. But, pumpkin people. Only one. It's like it's an endangered species. Where are, where are the rest of you people? I think I'm in the mood for this. And we got ourselves a diploma. I feel fancy. Boulder Bash Turbo. Yummy. It's made from the best stuff on earth. Yeah. Alright, so we must have something that's waiting in the queue here. There we go. And give me that crap, because we need that on the bottom. Oh, mushroom soup. Good. We got plenty of that. Got a lot of that stuff going on. Uh, okay, so let's uh, use our proper 
gardening tool here. Oh, no, I don't. Not doing that. No, thank you, buddy. Alright, so we got that going. Gonna beat the crap out of this competition here. Gonna teach him who's the boss. And, um. Here, you know what to do with that, so do it. And let's see what's going on over here on the right. Because we can. And hopefully something eventful is happening. No! Not at all. Alright, beat the crap out of some of these yams. I swear, where are the pumpkin people on this freaking stage? It's like, they like to taunt you a lot at the beginning and show you just like a... Alright, so the end of another day. Another wonderful day and we're kind of, I guess we're kind of up ahead. At least more so than what we were before. And technically, I guess it's like, so fever time. Nah, music stopped. Alright, so I guess trending soup is... Oh my god. Well, that was not intended, so let's uh, kind of get this fixed up quickly. So uh, a lot of wasted ingredients is always a bad thing. And of course, a competition just doesn't fudge off, man. And what would be really nice is, uh, you know, for some pumpkin people, finally. It's like, I've been good. I, was, I would expect, you know, a little bit better treatment here. So many ingredients depend on that one, too. We need the green shrubs, and we need some other stuff. God. What a process. And I already know what this is going to entail. It's going to be them in the bottom little pit there. Should just get Arthur's to do that stuff. Just, I mean, do it hardcore, man. It's like... Beat the crap out of them with the swords and the stuff. Well, I do have a new sword, so I'm going to take advantage. Oh, there we go. That's the stuff. And it's like they're walking right into a blender. That's what's going on here. Oh, and I did not want to eat that. Don't. Come on. Oh, you hate my soup? Are you serious? It's good quality stuff that's being sent out, and you're just spitting all over it. Lousy punks. Well, that one's made out of uh, the trending ingredients, so that should amount to something, you would think. Now let's see, this uh, green little shrub here, how do they like it? Okay, they're accepting of that. Not so much of uh, the other crap I sent out, but you know what? They're just picky eaters, that's all. And there's like a drought of pumpkin people, apparently. Because I have not found one ever in like the last day or two. It's like this is redonkulous. Let's uh, build a couple more here. Damn. These people are it's not relenting. Let me guess, uh, yeah, he finds that to be pretty detestable. Alright, uh, corn people, I don't really want to mess with that. 52%. Well, we don't even need these top towers, we really don't. We really don't. It's not helping us one freaking bit. Alright, so pumpkin people, I guess that's out. Uh, there's nothing we can do with that. It's just we can't find any, so what's the point? It's just slowing us down at this point. Oh, that's great. Thanks a lot, man. 
I wonder what suit that is, by the way. Ah, uh, it's just dumb. This whole stage, I tell ya. It's gonna be the death of me, I swear. Alright, so a mushroom and I guess a corn person. I, I know they're, they exist. So let's uh, go dig in this way here, and hopefully we can find them. Oh, the so's uh, okay. There's a bunch of tomatoes there. We don't lose those ingredients. What day is this so far? Um, day seven. Yeah, usually by this point we would be making a little bit more progress. Oh no, I'm getting the hell away from that. All right, so a bunch of tomatoes. Also, we have um, interesting. At least they're more plentiful than the pumpkins. And we're kind of doing away with that ingredient to begin with, well, doing away with that one as it is, so, yeah. Freaking crook, man. The guy's a crook. Alright, so we need the green stuff, we need the purple stuff, and we need some other stuff. Never ends in the world of uh, Nom Nom Galaxy. It really doesn't. And we need to grow these just because, well, uh, just because. Alright, so let's see, uh, we need the mushrooms, we need some uh, green stuff also here, so let's go ahead and pick this crap. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Alright, well I planted that there, so I'm kind of conserving stuff. I'm being a good guy. Alright, so let's drop that there, good. Um, Corn. Alright, they like corn apparently. We learned something. They like corn. But that pumpkin there is kind of not working out for us. Alright, so yeah, this is it's kind of fun just rushing back between point to point. Hoping to God we actually do something. Plant that there, and let's get this stuff here, because, well, don't even need to explain myself anymore, because it's pretty predictable at this point what's going on. Play by plays? Nah. Wow. Okay, so they're kind of getting an edge on us now, and that's kind of bothering me. It's really bothering me. like it should not be this difficult. I really blame the setup though, man. I really do. Alright, grab that. Good. So we need the shrooms. We definitely need the shrooms here. Drop that crap. We need the mushrooms. Uh, need some yams. Uh, okay, corn people. We need a lot of stuff. Starting to lose track of everything. And I'm going the route of uh, the corn people, so that's going to be interesting. Alright, that, that. Oh, really? Sucker. That didn't really hurt. Wow, okay, so we're going to be back to 50%, aren't we? But it's like, there's just so little room here for, like, any kind of automating crap. So I get a little restless. And again, I'm sure there's, like, something I'm missing here. It's like some really stupid thing, you know? Come on, five percent, one percent. 
What am I sending out that's like really bad here? Okay, let's see. Let's, let's kind of uh, backtrack a little bit here. Uh, okay, so this is our main base that we're kind of stuck with and screwed with. But how about this area where there's tomatas? We can. There's still room to possibly automate that. Right? Am I right? Is there something we can do here? I, I mean, this seems like a good place to... Whoa. Okay, I didn't go high enough, apparently. Okay. Okay, I have an idea. Just to automate some aspect of this, we're going to uh, set up shop here. So, let's go ahead and make a... Yeah, definitely a soup factory here. Soup factory there. Uh, we need a power generator. Ow. And I know there was a uh, one around here somewhere. So where was it? Because once we get this set up, then uh, I believe we can make some real magic happen. All that fancy shit. Okay, here we go. That's what I'm looking for. Because we're going to automate the Tomatis people. It's God, God forbid. If anything else is not going to work, this is going to work. And we have to make a long, lonely trek all the way over here. Oh, God. Huh. Huh. We're gonna do this. We are going to do this. We got the money necessary for this stuff, theoretically. Let's get rid of this crap. Because we don't need that. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, I hope that thing doesn't like grow over here. I hope I hope not. Get away from me! Get away from me, dude! Are you serious? You got a sword, you know that, right? Oh my god. Here, just please leave me alone. Please leave me alone, thank you. Wow, you people are rude. People are very rude. Better think about it, man. Okay, so um, let's go ahead and build. It's gonna work like a boss. It's gonna work. And let's uh, build some struts, cause uh, this stuff's gonna fall on us if we're not careful. Okay, we're gonna save this. We're saving this right now. And let's uh, kind of push that in this direction. Oh, okay. Uh, this is kind of begging for trouble here. Really, it is. Get away from me. Damn. Oh, man. Oh, and I'm dead. Mamma mia, and I'm dead. Oh, thank God. Huh. Don't mess with me, man. This is going to be our ace in the hole, hopefully. I mean, if as long as they like this kind of stuff, then we're fine. If they don't like it, then we're screwed. Because we're already in the 30%. So you know how it goes. This is the only thing I can think of at this point, is... Uh, Alright, so how do I get out of here? That's the question. Now hopefully he doesn't destroy that um, lovely little thing he's got there. Alright, so let's see. Let me think about this here. 
Get rid of that crap, and uh, boom. Wabooey. Kablooey. Yeah, that makes sense. And let's get rid of this little black eye also. Good, they like it. I think we got something here. We actually may have something going here for the first time ever. Oh, don't mind if I do. What we're going to have here is a whole, whole lot of fun here. No. Okay, there we go. We need to feed our habit, what can I say? They're going to like this, and they're going to like it a lot, because this is going to be a lot of soup to work with. Ow. People are being rude. You know that, right? Soup all day long, man. Yeah, we, we've got this now. When one approach fails, just take advantage of another thing that you have available to you. That base that we have right now is kind of junk. God, it's an embarrassment. So now this is going to be what wants us to match our secret weapon, let's say. So at this point, I think we got it. I think we got it. We have a really good chance here. So now, with our, our little setup here pretty much set up, let's uh, make our leave and go back to uh, crappier pastures. And, um, hmm. yeah, really crappy pastures because, well, that other base is just junk. I mean, I appreciate that they gave us something to work with right off the bat, but... Usually there are strings attached to that, such as you have to do some. Well, you have to work on their rules with it. So yeah, I don't want to play by those rules, to be honest with you. I'd rather do my own thing, and yeah. Now we have to go over here and kind of uh, beat the crap out of them, like always. See, 81%. We got this. And it's all because of tomatoes, uh, the tomato people. Alright, come on, you little jerks. Oh, they... Okay, I, I can't argue with that. If they want to be stupid and go over there, that's fine. Be my guest. And I wonder how the tomatoes, uh... How tomatoes production is going so far, because, uh... I would be expecting more soup to actually be coming out from there. So I mean, I hope this isn't a situation in which I have to kind of mediate things here. Oh good, okay, so they are sending some stuff out. That's good, because I do not want to be disappointed here. I really don't. I'm just thankful, like, uh, Arthur hasn't, like, destroyed the nest yet. That would have been just tragic, man. Alright, so we have 100% of the market share, so that's pretty badass. And now he sent his uh, desperation attack. Uh, his uh, wave against us. Is Are they over here? No, they're all down they're on the bottom there. A bunch of idiots. I am hungry, so let's uh, go ahead and kind of uh, feed our appetite here. Because we pretty much won this. Thanks to the tomato setup I had going there. So everything else is just not going well. It's not going according to plan one bit. So this was uh, my saving grace. My Hail Mary play, let's say. Because nothing else was going to work for us. Yeah, come on. Send your soup last. I dare you. Ah, uh, he's gonna... No, we got this. We got this. We should have enough time. That's fine. Guy doesn't have the cojones to actually send out another soup, do ya? Yeah, we got that many soup. Uh, that's more than enough insurance. 
So I appreciate the thought game and giving us this nice base to work with. But it really was useless, these defenses on the top never seem to work for this particular enemy because they always tend to spawn from the bottom. And that's uh, that was a close one game, throwing out fever time like that. But yeah, that was just a very weird stage. I don't really like when they actually provide you with the base pre-built. It's just, yeah. Iron suit. Increase Astro suit's defense by 30%. And that takes... Really? Wow. Okay, so Gatsudak. Gatsudak rests on the edge of the war zone, not the safest location for factory expansion, but there could be unexpected benefits. Well, this one was interesting. Kind of sucked, and the fact that they gave you the base already, but that's my own playing style. We got through it in one piece, and I guess we got Gatsudak to, um, do in the next episode so thank you as always for watching and i will see you next time